Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft. I'm your host, Anon Jr., and uh, we're going to wrap up what I hope... Well, I hope we're going to wrap up uh, some of the redstone on the community storage project back there. Let me uh, unmute Discord so we can all say hello. Howdy, howdy. Okay, good. I was getting worried that it didn't unmute again. Uh, I had that problem last time. Yeah, Arcadius is experiencing some microphone difficulties, which we will be troubleshooting yet again later on. Of course, I don't know why I keep closing that door every time I walk through. It's not like there isn't a big old hole right there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Isn't that one of your favorite types of shooting? All right, so, um, all right, we're gonna just put the whole wall there. All right. Hmm. Let me do a quick recap. Although, I gotta see if Twitch is in actually receiving the data because my dashboard on dashboard on this size just says sending data. Oh, there we go. <laughs> now it gave me an answer. The wrong answer, but it gave me an answer. Okay. Uh, and ladies and gentlemen, this is part of why I am switching to just going to Twitch exclusively after today. Today is the last day that I'm going to futz around with multi-streaming. After that, I'm just going straight to Twitch. It makes life a lot simpler. So, two weeks ago, we worked on the first part of the storage system. Our bulk storage is your um, basic sorting, like bog standard. You've seen it a blue million times. Water stream going across a line of hoppers with a filter up at the top that filters out the one item. And this is for all the stuff that we're going to have tons and tons and tons and tons of things of. Reyes was kind enough to give me a little entrance over here to get into the back, so if I need to troubleshoot redstone, I can. We'll probably clean up that and figure out just how far away that wall needs to be at some point. And then over here, we've got our multi-item storage that we built last week. And Reyes and I have been finding homes for all the different things. Mostly or asked. Why is there a bird? Never mind. I don't want to know. Okay. <laughs> uh, mostly or asked because this is her organization. Um, we've got some placeholders for 1.16 stuff. That way we're not sitting here in a in a whenever early 2020 happens and 1.16 is released. Although we're running out, running a little low on early 2020. And last, in the part that we're going to work on today, is the overflow storage. So, if it doesn't have a home in the bulk storage, or the bulk storage is full, I, I shudder to think. Uh, or it doesn't have a home in the item storage, or what placeholders we have are full. Or it's not stackable. It should go into overflow storage, which will be these rows of boxes over here. And then finally, we're going to have a little room for non-stackables that we're, we intentionally put away, like helmets and chest plates and totems of undying and that sort of thing. Um, that'll go here. That'll probably happen sometime over the weekend once I figure out just how much room I need to take up behind this guy. We did run a test Saturday or Sunday. Which was it? Uh, I believe it was Saturday. So we ran a test Saturday where I found out that the redstone that I had used to try to lock the hoppers uh, before the shulker boxes got broken off is also blocking the redstone. <laughs> so, so if you've still got items feeding through that box, it... it somehow shuts the rest off even though it shouldn't I, I don't know I'm confused 
what else is new? So, uh, I'll probably rip all that up and start working on that again later. But first, I need... I need some hoppers. Um, one of the quirks of this multi-item storage is that there has to be a placeholder item. You can't leave a spot blank. So you can't be that guy and grab the last dispenser and leave that empty. Otherwise, some random item will get stuck in there. And uh, all sorts of unfun will ensue. Uh, likewise, it's really not a good idea to be uh, manipulating items in uh, in the storage system until until it's done. Let 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 it run, lest you uh, cause other issues. Like you know, you pull out the stack to. And before you get a chance to drop that last one in, you, you don't want some random item dropping in there and doing something. Or at least doing something you didn't want. And now all that information is on tape. And there's a record that you guys were on the call when it happened. Cricket, cricket. Sorry, I'm um, I'm just listening. Trying not to die, huh? So I was just listening to you. Okay. All right. What I got to do now is I got to figure out how I want to get items out from under here. So right now, this barrel represents the overflow section. Um, I'm tempted. To use a hopper to feed them into a dropper, bring them up a water column right here, and then start running them back down this way. But first, let me get everything else that's going to have to happen. That way I know exactly how much space I have to work with. The nice thing about the overflow storage is it's not that complicated. Um, oh, I say right now, without falling off. Because uh, all I gotta do is run... Ooh, that might not work. If that's going up right there... Hmm. Hmm. Sorry, I just got a... Why do I have a random spectral arrow? I, I think that's what Arcadius is doing. I might have to return it via distance, uh... A long distance return. Yeah, alright. So I got a little bit of clearance up here. That's basically going to go in there. And I'm going to need another train that goes across this way. Come on. So you guys working on today? Uh, I haven't made my mind up yet. I need to finish that uh that volcano. But the volcano. Kind of, yeah, yeah, still still need to finish that up. Yeah. 
And I know I've got to do my part on trying to fix up the uh, um, smelting system. Because that's still on the agenda. Some interesting bits. Need a dropper. Gonna need some soul sand. If I was raised, where would I put the soul sand? Speaking of Rayist, where is she? She is working. Oh. Um, <laughs> someone broke your door? Like, how broke are we talking? Like a zombie broke it down, or... Seriously, you know, type to him when uh, it'll come over the chat. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay. Um, oh, that's right. I needed my other redstone box. accidentally drop my redstone box into somebody's inventory. <laughs> oh, she's not um, AFK and right next to our spot where we're picking up chests, yeah. so... Oh, you said she's not AFK and I'm like, let me double check the tab list. Yeah, yeah no. Yeah, that that was uh that that was not fun. That was a not fun part. Alright, um Actually what do we have here? We've got some green terracotta. Yeah, I guess I can make the rest of this column out of that. depending on what we got a lot of. And let's see. We've got... Not a lot of either. Into the glass, that at least... That way we'll at least be able to see when something isn't quite right. Hi. Just 
stupid in him, right? in the right spot. This rotated facing Ask what you're looking at, because a lot of the no, is going to get filled in. I was looking at the uh, which quartz blocks she was using, because there's uh, some missing over here, like right there. Yeah, because there doesn't need to be one there. Actually, no, now there does. Oh, it doesn't matter what's there. I mean, we we could seriously just do that, and it would be just as good. Just trying for uniformity. Who's going to see back here? Me. That's it. You, which means all of your viewers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not I'm not so fussed about making sure we have pretty quartz in the redstone underneath. <laughs> it can be seen. <sighs> Dang it. Hang on. Let me sleep. Uh -huh. I, I'd rather not have a creeper, you know sneak up and make the whole mm -hmm. whole discussion moot as we try to piece it all back together again. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, reservoir. Alright. Seriously, did you make it your goal to clog up my inventory with random stuff? <laughs> Trying to keep that stuff off the stream. No, legit, because, yeah. All right, uh, so we got quartz. And nah, I'm going to stick with the glass in case of the, instead of the terracotta, though. see that one, but okay. That one will go there. That one will go there. And that way, because basically the idea is we're dispensing the item, or <laughs> not dispensing, that's something different. We're dropping the item into the soul sand, and as long as there's no free block on any of the four sides around it, it will get pushed upward. And so we're going to put a water stream up on top of this. And that's what's going to go here. Uh, so I'm going to use some green glass for that. That way we got some visibility into the... Just in case there are problems. And the chests should keep all that contained too. I could put glass over the boxes there. And we don't have to worry about any any issues there. And actually that could go down by one. A hopper going in there.
close all that in. Let me get that there, that there. And... Yeah, and that should be everything we need to get that going. Uh, and a backup was run a couple days ago, just to be sure. I swear if I break any of this redstone, you're, you're going to see a grown man cry on camera. Oh, <laughs> I, I forgot because uh, because of all the uh, the lamps there that melted the ice, so I didn't have to worry about that. Nice. All right, we'll just do that right there, just like that. Et voila. That should actually be all our overflow. <laughs> oh wait, no, because I still got to do the uh, clock on the bottom. doesn't help to have um, that dispenser just sitting there. It doesn't do anything until we actually get the clock working. color so I don't uh, mistaken this for something else. just did this, what, yesterday? Saturday? Um, Alright. I'm today struggling with redstone.
Wow, I, I didn't realize we had an overflow of uh, brown dye already. I had an overflow of what? Brown dye. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that, I went through and I was harvesting oh. that for quite a while and just dumping it in our chest. Oh. Okay. spawnable surface well, except for that nope not anymore okay <laughs> alright I was kind of hoping Reyes would be on because I wanted to see how she wanted to handle the surplus of uh, non stackables Do we already really have it? Do we? Uh, blah, blah, blah. I promise this. Just soda in there. Oh, we really do already have three stacks of cocoa beans. Um. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's the good stuff. Wow. What's coffee without cocoa beans? Wow. Okay. I guess I'll just toss that into the overflow then. All right. Well, uh, yeah, and we got some buried treasure maps, which are not stackable. We got a salmon head, but I thought there was a squid head that went through there too. Or do we actually have a home for squid heads? I and why don't just believe so. <laughs> and why just the squid heads? Or is it well, I, actually, I think that back... We do have a home for squid heads, and it's in my uh, chest. Oh, did you already grab it? No. No, I'm just there, saying there, if... Uh, so there was one that went through the system. If squid heads need a home, they have <laughs> one in my chest. All right, so let me do that, which will unlock the whole system. And we dump in some dirt, some glass, some hoppers, some redstone, quartz. And we let it run. And while it's running, I'll come in here. Drop off my redstone boxes. And look for a refill on the enderpearls. Everything's flowing in here. We got that clock working so it is nice and spaced. That way, that system up there does not get uh, overtaxed. I was also smart. Left myself a way up instead of running through bajillions of ender pearls. Since almost none of this is going to come through this portion of the system, it's going to come back this way, drop down here. The water stream that carries it over to the next section is on the other side, so you can actually watch it as it goes by. Heads into this uh, input here, and it basically goes through a, a spiral. So it's going to go into that input chest. It's going to come all this way up this torch tower, over, and then over one, and then start its way down here. This system in between the torch tower and the hoppers is set up to periodically lock the hoppers on its way down. So it locks that hopper there, gives it a chance to flow into the box. If it does, great. The system's still going to keep running, but the item will go into the box. If it doesn't, it's going to unlock it enough to drop it down to this hopper, give it a chance to flow into the box. If it doesn't, then it's going to drop it down, rinse, repeat. And then as it goes down, it's going to hit there and go around to the next torch tower and spiral all the way across this column, then up to the top, this column, up to the top, this column, so on and so forth. Uh, Nimbom has the timing worked out so that that light stays on for the longest duration it could take for an item to get from the starting point all the way to the end, if it was in the last of all possible boxes. Um, 
So as long as that light is on, something is potentially going through that section of the system. Ditto for that one. I don't have one for this part. Um, I've thought about it, but I would have to figure out how long it would take to get from um, being dispensed and then getting all the way over here, whatever the longest possible time would be in the just run a lamp that gets its clock reset every time a new item goes through. And I'm not sure how useful that part would be. The, this, if you leave while it is running, it will break something. So you need to stay here until everything is done flowing through the system. So, with that light on, I'm not going too far. Except to semi-patiently wait. Uh, that does beg a question, though. Because there should have been two chickens in there. A troubleshooting chicken and a testing chicken. And we're missing a squid head. That has me slightly concerned. Unless it made its way to a different box. I have no redstone locking any of the boxes. Um, no bother. Um, no bother. Or oh no, 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 don't bother. No, 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 no. Why? Do you have the chicken? No. Oh. Then why are you saying don't bother? No, no, no bother. <laughs> Alright, it's not in the barrel. It's not in the hopper. It's not in the dropper. Where or where did my chicken go? That is two items lost by the overflow system. I didn't even think to double check that. I should have known better. Of course it can be that simple. I don't see it lying around over here. Uh, that block. Not lock it. Let's play some redstone parkour. Not in that hopper. Hmm. You sure one of you guys isn't messing with me? Nope. Oh, oh, oh. There's no ceiling there. Hmm. Where did the squid head and the other chicken go? Why did the chicken cross the road? To get away from the hunter. Alright, there's nothing left going through. That light is out. <laughs> Ray has told it to. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. <laughs> Java didn't go anywhere. He's a good boy. Alright. Do I really need to check each and every one of these hoppers? They're all 
facing in the correct direction. None of them's gonna get locked. Did, oh, did the chicken get stuck on one of the chests? Uh, let me go grab some scaffolding. Cause that'll be the next thing. That would mean that I'd have to find a different uh, different place to put that elevator. All right. If I were Ray asked, where would I put scaffolding? There we go. Hmm. I really need to work on the storage system because this is getting old having to try to remember where I put everything. Oh, I was going to say. What do you mean? What kind of storage no, system do you need? <laughs> no, my stuff. No, I don't want it. Like, I could have swore I had a bunch of hay bales, and I can't find them now. Ah. Uh. stuck no weird hitboxes oh. good save scaffolding going in. There should be 24 scaffolding on the other side. Grab a um, uh, 
I thought we had more green stained glass. Did I not toss them in there? Or did somebody pick up oh, some oh, green stained oh, glass? Oh, 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 oh. What was that? That was me jumping accidentally into the hole on the top of the volcano, and for some reason my rocket's not firing off. Well, that would that be a problem, though, wouldn't it? Yeah, that was lag. Hello down there. That sure is a uh, big ground room. Yeah. Yeah, it's looking good, isn't it? Well, I'd fall down, but I don't want my uh, rockets to not deploy. Yeah, I'd, I like was, the that plumes of smoke. Weird. Well, that's what I'm working on right now, and I've got an idea. I had to come over to get some carpet. Uh, you didn't happen to take any of the green glass, did you? Uh, negative. Although I do have a quite a bit of green glass, because uh, that's what I was using at my other base for the slime well, farm. No, I'm pretty sure I put more than three green glass in the system, and that's not what ended up in the in the boxes. No, I haven't. I haven't messed so, with them. A, a storage system that loses items is not, you know. <laughs> that's not going to be all that helpful. Just in case something got weird, let me go ahead and this button. Should start stuff moving if there's anything. <laughs> yeah, the wandering trader did it. Hmm. That should start anything moving if there's anything stuck. footage to see how much uh, glass I put in there. Roll that beautiful glass footage. Beautiful. That works beautifully. What are you face palming for? Unless you took it. No, I think that's in response to my little joke. Ah. Well, now I gotta double check too. Did, we, did all the hoppers get where they were? All right. Oh. Hmm. No, because that should have uh, that, that should have about covered the hoppers. And maybe the redstone dust. Something end up in a place it's not supposed to be. I 
didn't accidentally pick anything up. Just for kicks, let's uh let's run the trouble shooting chicken through again. Oh. Or was that not done yet? No, doesn't seem to be it. Is that a golem or is that the chicken? No, oh, no, the chicken's already over there. Oh. Or is there an empty space that got forgotten? Alright, that is full. There's supposed to be a placeholder in every spot. Placeholder in every spot so far. Uh, cobble. Oh wait, no. I need that half slab. Stone. Stone. Mossy cobble. So far, so good. Placeholder dubious value. So yeah. No. <laughs> we seriously have a box that's just a placeholder box. We seriously have a box that's just a placeholder box. Okay. Ours not to wonder why. Something something. So far so good. Alright. Are you laughing at the fact that there's just a placeholder box? Because, uh... I mean, part of me wants to be mad about that. But on the other hand, I can't really be mad about that. Since I am sure we're going to find out the hard way that we kind of misjudge something. Come on, it's clearly night enough. Betty, bye. This is a creeper-free workspace since at least two days ago. Check the obvious there. I have a visitor in chat. Oh, hey, Pink Geek. I, I moved my chat over to the right monitor, so it's, I, I don't quite see it as uh, as quickly as I should. I'm used to having it on the left. I may have to move that again. Yeah, we got a couple blocks. That's where all the warped... Oh, that's not all warp planks. Oh, also the warp plank stuff. And the warped wood and... And all the crimson stuff. And more of the crimson stuff. I'm checking because we're missing a couple items that went through store <laughs> the storage system. Uh, this is the one that gets me. It is... <laughs> Some placeholders of like, I don't know. Because uh, somebody said 
that we needed one more panel of these. So in other words, this is one whole segment of the storage system uh, as built by Nembom and in the world download. And that's a second one. And somebody was trying to tell me that we needed a third one. That same person was going, uh, what do we want to put here? I, I got to have something here because he said there, there can't be any empty spaces. Also, I need to see if I have any emerald ore to put in the emerald ore placeholder. We'd need at least three. Alright, so far I'm not finding any empty spaces that could have accidentally gone into. Not yet, anyway. Fish. Or surf and turf. <laughs> oh no, no. I, I, I said it while she was here. I, I gave her a hard time about it the whole time she goes, well, then what do we put here? I honestly think we're going to need more than a placeholder for the golden apples and golden carrots. That's probably going to get um, broken out at some point. No, that's actual paper. Okay. Not placeholder paper. And bones and bones and dry bones. Oh, that's going to be a lot of feathers. Uh, not until 1.16. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, like we got a bot. <laughs> we got a row of name tags and a box of placeholders. A row of leads and a box. <laughs> And the rest of placeholders. <laughs> yeah, we do have plans on uh, on building a decent sized gold farm, but there's no reason to do it right now until yeah, not not until the Nether update. Uh, I thought you could buy the golden apples too, couldn't you? Because I know you can buy the golden carrots. That, that's been my food source, even though I've holy mother of dragon's breath, Batman. That's a lot of dragon's breath. <laughs> well, you know, Arcadius and I did uh, go after the dragon like six or seven times with full stacks of empty <laughs> bottles to do nothing but capture all the breath. <laughs> wow. No, I, I didn't realize that you had full stacks of empty bottles like that. Oh, yeah, those are the blue torch and blue lanterns. Room lights whenever they get here. Time in early 2020. I'm curious what else they're going to surprise us with. Oh, <laughs> you guys weren't there for that one. Um, when Reyes found out that it takes a diamond to make a jukebox. Because she was getting ready to make a, a row of jukeboxes worth... Uh, <laughs> enough jukeboxes to do a row of placeholders. And I was like, uh... <laughs> sure about that all right I'm not imagining things did I oh yeah that's right there's a lot of TNT there too and <laughs> Medic has... Oh, yeah, that's right. For the uh, construction project, right? I shouldn't have all of them. You're richer than me. Well, he's done more digging than most of us. I'm feeling unintentionally like that. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> He's going to have the TNT anyway. <laughs> we might as well at least know where it is so we can know where to look. <laughs> uh, 
besides the uh, tree farm that I do plan on building now that we got time uh, or uh, now that we got this project out of the way the uh, tree farm is going to be TNT based and I'm not going to bother making a TNT duplicator to run the tree farm just because uh, Moyang seems uh, how shall I put it uh, highly motivated to make sure that uh, that it that it uh, that item duplication is not a thing which is fair I always felt kind of cheaty about it that's why I didn't build any rail duplicators this year that's why I didn't build any carpet duplicators this year I didn't even know carpet duplication was a thing yeah, carpet duplication is a thing. Uh, I did that last last go round, but honestly, with the wool farm we got going, I don't think we need to worry about carpet duplication. Well, that, that's that was kind of my point. Was um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you do you do a good wool farm? You don't need carpet duplication. Yeah, but of course, we didn't have a good wool farm because farm. we had started uh, we had started that world as a. Um, 1.13 world and you couldn't shear sheep in 1.13 that came later in 1.14 and by the time we got that set up uh, the, the carpet duplication was already in place and you know that was easier alright um, did I accidentally turn something when I was moving that, uh, that I was trying to rotate this guy That goes in there. Goes down that way. That goes down that way into that. Hmm. I still can't shake the feeling that one of you guys is messing with me. <laughs> and randomly grabbing stuff. I'm not in any, anywhere over there. I love how you, you're not denying that you would totally do that. Just, you oh, know, no, I, would, I would if I. Had, sad thing is, if I would have thought of it, I would have done it. Oh. <laughs> uh. Maybe I should stand over there on top of the glass, and oh. every time you throw something in there, it just, just pops it into my inventory. <laughs> no. <laughs> That would have been funny. Alright, um... Now I am deeply perplexed. stuck I guess that's the big issue is where where would it have gotten stuck because the glass wouldn't have gone we just checked all the boxes that it could have gotten stuck in and it's not there hmm Where's my hairbrush? Thank you for that one. Uh, no, none of the... If it was in a locked hopper, it would have been in one of the hoppers locked before here. And those are all fine. Right, at least I got back all that. Of course, now i got to go back and find out how much... Maybe I didn't put that much uh, green stained glass back in there. Is that what I'm imagining? Do I need to roll back the uh, replay footage to see? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. That's the cake. Totally a lie. 
uh, no, because I put the ice in here. And the comparators and repeaters, because I'm going to need those soon. Blah, 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 words. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. It's not going to be in any of those. Alright, while I'm contemplating... While I'm contemplating where that could have possibly gone... It wouldn't have been in any of these filters. He says as he looks anyway. the system that is not working correctly anyway. Because this is where I'm getting the accidentally locked up hopper. Uh, quartz blocks. Did I not fill that in? I must not have filled that in. Oops. Yeah, because that redstone line there is powering that block, which is powering that redstone, which is locking up that hopper. Just, just remember who has admin. That's all I'm saying. jack-o'-lanterns so I can get that set up because uh, I can't get I can't figure out how to get it to lock it so that way the shulkers don't get sucked into the system when you're done using this and I might switch to a different uh, shulker unloading system I'm trying to find one that will when it's done unloading the shulker box will uh, squish the shulker box and break it into a storage that will be over here where you are so it doesn't feed the empty empty boxes into storage and you have to sit here waiting until it cycles all the way through to the end here. Um, smooth quartz. That's, right. That's what I came for. Smooth quartz and... and something. Oh, jack-o'-lanterns. Uh, lighting. And I need a redstone torch. Oh, 
gonna bother me. Where did those items go? I mean, at this point, if they were stuck somewhere, they would have despawned. So it's not like I'm gonna see them stuck somewhere. But it really bothers me that I can't figure out where they would have gotten stuck. So far, nothing's gotten stuck on this side falling down, and it is one of the areas that I do have some slight concerns. Yeah. I, I'm probably going to go back over the footage to make sure that the number I put in... <laughs> oh, yeah, llamas. We got uh, the llama drama. <laughs> and Sancho Panza. Over by Don Quixote. Don Quixote. Don Quixote. <laughs> I don't have drama with my llamas, but those aren't my llamas. They, they belong to the person who hasn't uh, decided to settle in on an area and call it their base. <coughs> Rest. <clears throat> So I want... That should be more than enough lighting. I say until I find out that it's not enough lighting. Do not have a dozen more. Less than half dozen. Less than half. I'll keep typing. Yeah, I don't know where either. They, they just kind of wander in. Actually, no. I, I, I stopped earlier than that, but somebody kept donating them to me, so I'd check and see how much uh, storage they offered, and then uh, if it wasn't if it wasn't what I needed, I, I brought them to the Lama Retirement Home. Well, you did say you needed llamas. I was just trying to help you out. Yeah, that was, that was, <laughs> that was a few llamas before that. <laughs> All right. Uh... That is all... Yeah, that's all redstone. Arcadius, I need more lava. Alright. Better find out. <laughs> Who are you, the SPCA? They went to the Lazy Llama Retirement Home. Alright, so when I get done, there should be, uh, you know, let me... Uh, let me I a book without uh, dropping everything. Not unless you had more somewhere I didn't know about. Should be 16 green. Perfect. There should be 10 green wool. There should be another 14 orange wool. Never mind. I found the lava. You found the lava? I found the lava. Was it in the nether? No, nah, it was in the three boxes. Ah. Is this like the three seashells thing, or 
Is that something different? He doesn't know how to use the shells. All right, we're gonna need. We're gonna end up with 19 jack o' lanterns. Six redstone dust. And... Repeaters. Another... 35 repeaters. Should all work with those boxes extended. There we go. It's getting dispensed up that way just fine. Nothing is getting caught over here. way through this sorting system. And nothing should be hitting the overflow. Because it's all stuff that it should end up there. We're missing a diagnostic chicken. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. Wait. I ran both chickens through, didn't I? Am I missing both of them now? things getting stuck. breaking too much. Yeah, because now that I think about it, I sent the other, I sent the diagnostic chicken through and it didn't come back around the other side. Although, I still reserve the option that Arcadius is just randomly grabbing stuff to screw with me. <laughs> Poor Arcadius, always getting blamed. Oh yeah, yeah, poor Arcadius. Poor Arcadius. Alright, uh, carpet wool, jack-o'-lanterns, redstone, that's all stuff that's going to be on this side. So once that's done running, I can do a quick check. <laughs> the chicken went home due to shutdown. Well, it clearly did not stay in place. Okay. So green carpet. 
We now have 16 green carpet, 10 green wool. We've got our 14 orange wool. We've got our 19 jack-o'-lanterns. Our 46 redstone dust. And our 35 repeaters. Okay. So, if there is a legitimate issue, and that is an if, it's somewhere between the multi-item storage system and overflow. Okay. bubble column through and through so that is water sources all the way up or we wouldn't have that other items made their way through I break another keyboard by spilling something. Uh, Alright. Helps if you hit the right key. So this chicken should end up over in the overflow. that way cross that way probably already got across before I got here yep making its way through this panel where it will not find a home uh, welcome to troubleshooting redstone where you lose what little hair you have That's why you're the man. Yeah, sure, we can go with that. I mostly just keep, you know, stringing stuff together until something works. Still hasn't hit the second panel yet. The system doesn't seem so slow unless you're sitting there watching it, trying to like, okay now, when you get to get to the next part. to know, uh, know that it actually worked. Okay, no, now it's in the second section. Slowly, steadily making it in. <laughs> Eventually. Yes, you are. that you did. <laughs> All right. Where's the old man switch that lets you uh, go to bed early? 
I see you. There is just a little bit of a delay. Um, even though I don't have a delay set up on my end, Twitch will delay things by anywhere from 6 to 10 seconds because uh, reasons. And so... <laughs> and so uh, but when you chat back at me, it is near instantaneous. So I say hello... Six to ten seconds go by, you chat back, hello, and I see it, but I'm already six to ten seconds on to the next thing. It is one of the things that I am truly, truly struggling to deal with. Uh, because I don't always remember what I just said six seconds ago. Much less ten. <laughs> Short-term memory something or other. Can't remember what it's called. Okay, so the chicken made it through. Then where's, where's the, where's the items that went missing? Yeah, I'm, tr I'm trying to keep that sort of stuff. <laughs> Thanks. Those are the things you don't post publicly for reasons. No, I thought confused. it was just me getting in trouble. <laughs> yeah, no, no. All right. So we're missing three items that randomly disappeared. It is somewhere in the overflow that they went. So where could they have gotten stuck and why intermittently? Obviously, it's not every time, because those items went through. The only thing I can think of is... Uh, <laughs> uh, no, not not live. Um, yeah. The only thing I can think of is, is getting stuck on one of the, on one of the boxes, but I don't... I don't see why it would. The, the sides of the box cover up enough that nothing should be getting stuck there. Although, that is should being the operative word. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe, uh... Maybe I do need to move this water stream. <laughs> oh, don't worry. They'll see it. Chat is public. <laughs> Everybody watching sees it. Uh, hmm. Maybe I do need to move that then. Really don't want to though. All right. Um, where's the sponges? If I were Ray asked, where would I put sponges? That might be one of the ones she forgot. No, I know she's getting... There we go. Figure it out eventually. Oof. 11 hours. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah, and right now, the shop that I'm working at, is, we might be closing, we might not. Uh, there's a couple of stores that we would still service if we are not closing. However, the main warehouse that makes sure that we have stuff is closing. So. Oh. Wow, that cleared out all the water. Yeah, I'm wondering if something didn't get 
pushed out down here and just didn't notice it until it had already despawned. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> So anyway, we may we, we may be going on furlough soon, just depending on uh, on what's going on. Wait, no, I am going to need that. Gonna go there. soon enough. Am I even going to be able to run that across there? I need... Uh, yeah, they have talked about compensation. Uh, the last thing I heard is that we would be given 10 days pay, then allowed to use our vacation and sick leave, and then we would officially be on furlough, in the hope being that the 10 days pay and the vacation and sick would be enough to uh, allow unemployment benefits to kick in. So that would be the bridge between uh, not working and getting unemployment benefits. That is the current discussion, at least. All right. How creative do I want to get with trying to fit this in <laughs> in a particular water stream? I basically got to get it out of that out of that uh, barrel, or at least where that barrel is. All right, let me grab the rest of that glass while I'm thinking about it. Oh, I didn't realize that he waived the two-week uh, waiting period. So that is that is at least uh, that is good, and I'm thinking too of some of the uh, some of the guys on the retail side who are already on furlough, uh, who really need the benefits to kick in like yesterday. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, good. Just checking. Wouldn't be the first time that uh, something ended up getting sucked into the hopper somewhere. <laughs> oh man. Okay. So how creative do I want to get in ra Oh, ice. That's what I was looking for. I was looking for packed ice. Which we don't have a lot of. Okay, so I'll dip into my personal supply. I get a little bit of packed ice. Oh. <laughs> there we go. All right. Uh, so here's the thought. I set a offer. this clock here. That's not going to fit there anymore. Oop. Fill that space so nothing goes there. So if I put the hopper, if I put the dropper there, 
run some ice across that way, I'm going to run into that redstone right there. So that is not going to work. But... No, because that's going to cut into the quartz that you can see from the other side. Because I was thinking maybe if I just put the... Uh, dropper where the barrel is, but I can't run the clock that'll run it that way. That'll run into the redstone there. I can't run it that way because that'll run into where you can see the quartz there. I can't run it that way because, well, we got much too much. And if I were to run it this way, I'd end up locking some of those hoppers when I didn't need them to. Um, although, that wouldn't be the end of the world. Because even if I lock those, it's only going to go, it's only going to lock while the clock is uh, cycling through. And then it's just going to, and then it'll end up in, uh, in the box. Well, that might be the way to go. Um, yes, I've been getting a lot of messages today. All right. Let's do this. Let's go. Down. Let me go grab some clear glass. same problem. That's going to end up being too low. Even if I put the defense... well... No, because even if I put the dispenser there, I still need a space for the items to dispense out and flow, and that's going to put the, uh, the waterway going there. Well, unless I take it the long way around. <laughs> Well, now I can't run it that close because that means I wouldn't be able to put it there. So... This is just going to end up being the most convoluted, uh... We, we are, and I'm also trying to keep the chat family friendly. We could definitely use the rain. Yes, we could definitely use the rain. Um, Get rid of it. <laughs> well, especially with the whole, you know, everybody's worried about every sniffle and sneeze, um, and we're in the midst of allergy season. <laughs> you know, when everybody is dreadfully worried about every possible sniffle. All right, <laughs> yeah. Right. Careful if you're sneezing, and uh, oh yeah, it's allergy season. Uh, <laughs> Want to come out this way? And then, All right, Arcadius, uh, come up to the top of your mountain, or uh -oh. or the top of my mountain. Bother. Cause I don't think that's gonna. <laughs> uh oh. I always get worried when you're busy like that. Where, uh... Ooh, ooh. My input is going to end up being right there. That means I got to get it over this side here. Oh, 
well, that's not going to work. life interesting now, doesn't it? I wonder if I could fit a torch tower up this way. I'd have to get rid of the lighting. But I might be able... Uh... Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, alright. New plan. Go get my redstone box, a bunch of droppers, and a whole bunch of observers. Um, right now, I'm playing a lot of public domain music, or music that's been cleared for copyright issues on streaming and that sort of stuff. Um, but I recently upgraded my uh, Streamlabs subscription in the hopes that I'd be able to play a wider variety of music. Because, I mean, I like it, but I got the same dozen songs. And uh, it's the same dozen songs I've been using for about a year now. Which is nice. But not for a year now. <laughs> I just haven't had a chance to look at the Streamlabs library and see what they had available. Actually, I think it's a little bit more than 12 tunes, but yeah, the basically the same playlist I've been using on, on the live stream for the last year. Um, I mean, it was great when I got started, but the uh, the library hasn't expanded to, uh, to my tastes. If you like uh, techno dubstep, then, then there's plenty. There's plenty to pick from. Um, not not my uh not my style not my jam I can see you jamming up some skrillex <laughs> some skrillex yeah totally careful with that thing though um, since I'm not sure if uh, the pink geek knows or not one of the data packs that we have running on our server is a redstone wrench that lets you rotate redstone components uh, it is one of the best things we ever got except um, one of the problems we were running into with the storage system earlier was uh, I, I went to rotate one thing and rotated three other things around it. So all the routing was, uh, we'll call it special. It was special. It was something very, very special. Uh, so that need, that is facing down. Oh, oh, there we go. Done. All right, so the idea is... I 
need an observer that is going to look at that guy. And I need his output to go into a tower up that way. Right? Yes. power that block. What is that block going to power that I don't want? Yeah. Yeah, I would I wouldn't mind some decent classics, but unfortunately a lot of the a lot of the classics that I would want to use are copyright protected. And, and ridiculously so because by all rights they should have gone to the public domain, but they haven't. And that's kind of the crux of it. Matter of fact, uh, a lot of people are learning the hard way just how crazy the copyright system has gotten because teachers are afraid to read books on online uh, remote classroom sessions with their kids because they're worried about running afoul of copyright law. Um, which is seven kinds of ridiculous. Uh, if, if you're really looking for a good breakdown, I recommend some of the articles that TechDirt has written um, covering that end of things. But yeah, there are teachers who aren't sh who are worried about it. Um, LeVar Burton was worried about doing some uh, reading Rainbow <laughs> because he he wasn't sure if he was going to run afoul of copyright stuff or not. spot there. bottom dropper and when he sees it he's gonna fire off a redstone pulse into that block which that observer will notice and fire off a pulse which that observer will notice and fire off a pulse and basically every every other ooh, that actually means that I probably want this guy here anyway Because when that guy fires, he's going to notice, fire that one, which should trigger that one and the one below. And then run one of those every other. And I'm just going to go, oh, yeah. And that's not going to run into any of the redstone because observers only fire a pulse in the one direction. It also means that I don't need that glass. I don't need that there. Or there. We're there, but while I'm here, we're gonna want it there. Scaffolding. Alright, 
So I'm going to come up. That's underneath. So this is the one that I want. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. I just found out that s smoke goes through concrete powder. Uh, smoke should go through anything at least one block above it. But the, the block has to be directly above the fire. If it's more than that above it, it will not go through. Because reasons. But yeah, it will go through the concrete powder too. If that's the look that you're going for. I wasn't sure if that was a question of look or if that was just a question of uh, what it will and won't go through. Well, you can see that it... This? I put the carpet down to just kind of blend it in from the sky but yeah. of course down here you can see where the carpet's at now that I know I can put a full block over the top of it I can match it up a little better oh yeah and to the best of my knowledge it's got to be the block immediately above the fire anything anything more than that and it, uh, and it won't work so what do you think about his little entrance over here I like this. I take it's, it he's planning uh, on putting a... Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, believe it or not, you can make uh, smoke signals with the campfires. The 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 idea is you, uh, you get a campfire that's already exposed. I was you can expose that one. Too, too much. There you go. There you go. So these uh, campfire blocks are relatively new. Uh, they let you cook food on them and all sorts of other fun stuff. And if you put a hay bale underneath it, it'll actually make the smoke go up further than it normally would. So you can get a little variety in the uh, smoke size, which it looks like we got going here already. Mm-hmm. Nice. Uh, but somebody actually figured out how to block the smoke and unblock it uh, with the right degree of frequency to actually get Morse code. Um, and Mumbo Jumbo, one of the, uh, one of the big redstone YouTubers out there actually figured out how to make a keyboard <laughs> so you could actually program letters to show. So a smoke E will pop up and then a smoke A will pop up and then, you know, whatever it was that you decided to do. That volcano is coming out nice, though. Are, are you going to dot more of the uh, smoke along the way, or...? Uh, I, I need to finish up the backside and then fly around it and see if there's any obvious places that I want to put it, but for the most uh, part... This, this is, this is Hollywood. Is, as long as the front looks good, you know. Yeah, mo <laughs> most of it's uh, completed. Yeah, that is looking nice. Thank you. A little dangerous, but one creeper in that lava is going to cause a lot of fun. <laughs> oh, you should you should see it at night, though. It looks I, amazing I have seen it at, at night. night. It looks good. All right. I need these guys. So we got that guy, and then up oh, two. Wrong direction. All right, let's uh, step back just a little bit more. There we go. Up to. There we go one up. up. All right, that should. Should make that go all the way up. Easy way to find out. Let's uh drop a block in there. No. Of course not. I missed something. What did I miss? Let's uh let's change this iron block for a lamp. Do I have a lamp? No, I don't have a lamp. 
I should have one in here. Yes. That way I can at least tell if that guy's... F Ooh. I did something wrong. That should... Why are you firing? I see. Because I put the lamp down, and that triggered that. That triggers that guy, which is triggering both of those guys, which is triggering that guy, which is why this is not the way I need to do this. <laughs> All that work. All that work. guys out. I'll leave that there. You. Oh, no, that was not good. I hear the job. Yeah. That's what that was. Let me go check on the other side. All right. Um, going up to. That should be right. Yes, the feeding of the Jubba. A regular event. I mean, not as regular as he would like, but a regular event nonetheless. Okay, and no delay. so many enderpearls. Alright, let's try this a little different. Yeah, there's been a little bit of Grubhub and uh, DoorDash and a few others. It's only going to light up when that does. As long as the tower... other stuff and I can go back to this tower up here um mostly seems to depend on who supports what because that is that is the big issue is some people only have this one others only have that one and others will take your money whichever way you want to send it to them should be that should be it there all right 
Let's test this again. Did a block of quartz end up there? All right, block of quartz made it. Now, the only problem that I can see with this particular setup is if more items enter the dropper faster than it can dispense. Because this whole thing requires that comparator to change. And I can't take the output over here, do anything with it. Um, <laughs> uh, so far, that hasn't really come up because it's either been they support one or the other um, or none of them. Although now might be a good time to go check around and see uh, who's added additional delivery options. Let's go to the hopper that's going to feed that. Let's drop in 28 glass blocks. Yep. Okay. That's what I was afraid of. I need to get that comparator to pulse. Can't run the elevator up that this side. I can't run it up that side. All right. That's not going to work. Seven and no, there's 28. Okay, at least I didn't lose anything. Um, yeah, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, it's more, or you know, am I in the mood for some Mexican, some Italian? What kind of Italian? I guess I could run the water tower up this way, too. No, I can't. I can't. Not with all that redstone over there. Um, hmm. On today's episode of Struggling with Redstone... That's just not fair. There we go. Um, that's the other problem with the music is not all the songs are volume leveled. I, I've tried to do everything I can do on my end. And so some of them end up a little quieter than others. And, uh, yeah. Makes life interesting. <laughs> uh oh, what's that laugh for? Because I'm over here, like, wait a minute, I haven't heard music the entire stream. Because I have, yeah, I have the stream up. No, I have the stream up, and I'm like, wait a minute, I haven't, I don't hear music. I haven't heard the entire stream, and then I realize I have the stream muted. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> nice. Oh, don't don't let me forget to uh, make you one of the moderators on the channel, medic. I, I there's really no reason to do that right now because uh, <laughs> this is the first time I've been on Twitch in several months. Yeah, but you are gonna. Are you planning on starting streaming? 
I am. I just have to get things fixed. Um, I did. I did some uh, changing of stuff when I was having all my video problems, uh -huh. and it caused me to lose my my stuff with Twitch. So I have to go in and fix a bunch of that before I can start streaming again. Gotcha. So let's try this. All right, I'm going to have to go AFK for a minute. I shall be back. Thanks for the warning. <laughs> said nobody on the server. so yeah, we've done a few we've done a fair amount of Oof, yeah yeah 4 a.m. definitely comes early every day because again for now we're open but uh actually don't want that well, that's gonna power it anyway but uh I have not checked my mail today I got a message that something had come into via Amazon but uh, I didn't get a chance to pick it up It's nighttime. I should probably sleep. I had, uh. Yeah, I was planning on doing that while this uploaded. <laughs> no, sleep is for survival in this game because, uh. <laughs> if you don't sleep, zombies and skeletons and other things that want to kill you come out at night. To include, uh, creepers who like to blow up. And then they blow up all your stuff. <laughs> and that is usually the definition of a very bad, no good day. Actually, take this lamp off of here. <laughs> yeah, sometimes Arcadius does that. He did it that one time that he's admitting to. All right, so that clock is gonna cause this to pulse as long as items are in here. So now all I need to do is, I don't, I don't want to power this block off of this. Uh, all right, I guess it doesn't matter. I guess it doesn't matter. It's fine. That should not interfere with that. 
because we're powering that block off to the side. No. Ooh. And if I run the redstone signal in there, that's going to... No, that's only going to lock that hopper if I run this one into it. So this one's already going to pulse up into that one, so that means... Do I need another one here or another one here? Let's do this. Let's... How high does he get? He should get there. No, he got there. Okay. Okay, so then I can go... Nope, not there. I can go... you, Chubba. Hey, thank you for the follow. Hello. Um, I'm happy to see you on Mixer, but I've, I've got some... Uh, this is actually my last day simulcasting to both Twitch and Mixer. I am going to be going exclusively Twitch after this, just because of some issues with Mixer. Um... Yeah, and, and I kind of, I know that's going to be a problem for the Xbox people. Although I thought there was a Twitch client for Xbox, no? I seem to recall something about that. interfered with anything else. Nothing should be powering that lamp accidentally. Nothing should be powering that block accidentally. Yeah, we're playing on PC. Java Edition. We're using um, Kubetos as our hosting service. I mentioned that uh, even though that there's no, no financial yada yada uh, they've been a very, very nice upgrade for us. Because prior to that, we were using recycled Alienware PC, that uh, an old laptop that I had had. And it ran great for, you know, three people on much earlier versions. But uh, these days, not so much. And Cubedose has really helped fill that goal, or fit that. away. <laughs> yeah, but I've been here lately, I've been having some really weird issues with Mixer suddenly deciding that I wasn't authenticated or dropping the stream. Um, 
or causing some other uh, some other real weirdness. And that's been uh, that's been a little bit of an issue. All right. Um, my packed ice back. But we do post. Uh, well, I, I post all my live streams up to the YouTube channel. There should be a link in there too. And uh, CoffeeCraft.us will have where to find all the various all the various members and where they happen to be as well. Put my uh, redstone boxes away. Oh, uh, you know what? I don't think Rest has a spot for the uh, wet sponges. Yeah, we'll leave a spot for that. Oh, thank you much. We uh, we're actually gonna be, we went a little bit longer than I normally go, but I did want to get uh, the storage system troubleshooting finished. So if you want to catch the earlier part, that'll get uploaded to YouTube in about in a couple of hours. But uh, I am still working at least for a little bit while longer, and uh, 4 a.m. 4 a.m. comes early. Some of these things put away. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why I'm bothering. Uh, why am I trying to hunt down all the boxes? That's what we got this thing for. There. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> so we got a little shulker unloader there, a box there to just dump whatever random stuff. Ops up here goes through our bulk storage sand and dirt and things that we tend to accumulate a large amount of we got some placeholders in case we figure out there's anything else we need and then uh, multi-item storage I gotta get the sign up that has a link to Nembomb's video for uh, for which version we used of that and then whatever doesn't end up in the multi-item storage ends up in the overflow here, which is what we ended up uh, fixing today. And if we run out of uh, overflow storage, something has gone horribly, horribly wrong. And then this last little bit is going to be for non-stackables, organized non-stackables, as opposed to just letting everything collect in the overflow. You know, things like uh, helmets and chest plates and leggings and... Uh, I was about to say booties, but that's probably not right either. Um, oh, oh my. Totems of Undying. and well, You know, they, they could be the little safety booties that all the nurses wear. Or are supposed to wear. <laughs> oh, somebody already slept. Okay, good. So with... Uh, this massive star storage system behind me this is where i say thank you for joining along i hope you enjoyed uh we stream coffee craft live on tuesdays at 6 p.m u.s eastern every week and the replays get uploaded to the youtube channel the link in the description and now that uh now that my guitar repair classes are over i should be getting back on track to recording some uh regularly produced episodes as well and uh, look for that on the youtube channel as well as the other show i do called games revisited which streams live thursdays at, U at 6 p.m u.s eastern and uh also uh shows up over the course of the week on the youtube channel i've also got a link to my Streamlabs page down in the description so if you feel like uh tossing a coin to your admin O oh, server of plenty you, you can definitely do that there, and it'll also give you links to uh, where you know the YouTube channel, the mixer uh, that will no longer be live after this. I, I love how you're sneaking around there, good sir. Uh, that's also because I forgot to put it over here. So, 
Oh, uh, thank you, thank you. Have fun, enjoy, and if I don't see you on YouTube, I will see you next week. Bye.